Hi everyone and uh, welcome uh, for la leçon du jour, your French lesson of the day. Today we will uh, see les verbes réguliers en IR au présent. Okay, so uh, as you probably know in French we've got uh, three group of verbs and uh, les verbes réguliers en IR, so the ending with IR, are the second group. So be careful because it doesn't mean that even if a verb is ending with a ER, it does belong to this group because we've got some other verbs ending with ER who belong to the third group, so irregular verbs. Okay, but then in this case, uh, I decided to choose uh, finir. Okay, so important thing is that you, well, we just put the, the, the ending ER, okay, and it gives you, as I said, some useful information whether it's uh, for the second group or third group, okay? So in this case, ER is regular, so it does belong to the second group of verbs. And so you just take this ending away, and the idea is that you will get this FEN. So that's the first part, and you will combine it with the endings that we will see right now uh, to get the form. So for the first person of the singular, so JE, the ending is ES. So for our example with the finir, so you combine the first part that we get FEN and then you add it uh, or then you add this ending so ES and you will get the form JE FINI. Repeat. JE FINI. Okay, so you see that this verb is ending with a S but then you don't pronounce it. Alright, so it's JE FINI. Okay, second form for tu, okay, it's uh, ES, just the same, okay, so you get just the same pronunciation, but it's tu fini, okay, repeat, tu fini, okay, third person for il and elle, so still at the singular, you get ite, okay, and so pronunciation is still the same, and it's il fini, Repeat. Il fini. Okay. And then elle fini. Repeat. Elle fini. Okay. So you can see that for je, tu, il, and elle, it's actually the same form you pronounce, but then you write them differently. For je, it's es, tu, es, il, elle, it. Okay. So let's see how it goes for nous. Okay. So as you can see, for nous, the ending is. Ils sont, okay, I S S O N S. All right. So you get the form nous finissons. Repeat. Nous finissons. All right. For vous, you get ic, I S S E Z. Okay. So you can see that the ending, the last two letters, so E Z, are pronounced like E. Okay. Ic. All right, and you get the, the form vous finissez. Repeat. Vous finissez. Okay. And last but not least, uh, for il and elle, at the plural, fo plural form, you get is. Okay. I s s e n t. Okay. And as usual for the verbs, you know this e n t is not really pronounced. It only gives you the pronunciation of the s. Okay, so you get for the verb you will get il finis. Repeat il finis. Okay, and then el finis. Repeat el finis. Okay, be careful because it is a, a quite common mistake for this uh, uh, third person of the plural that the, the students pronounce finissant, okay, because they spot this uh, a n and so they think that they, they should pronounce uh, it. But then uh, keep in mind that yeah, each time for the third person of the plural for these verbs, so the uh, er verbs of the second group, and it's the same for the, the first group, you don't pronounce them, so it's finis. Okay? Alright, so let's see the endings again. For je, it's es, for tu, it's es, for il, it's it, elle, it, nous, issons, vous, issez, il, issent, and elle, issent. 
and then finally before leaving you just how do we pronounce them so for je it's i for tu it's i for il and elle it's i for nous it's i sont for vous it's i c'est and then for il and elle it's is okay all right so uh, do hope it's, it was clear for you <laughs> uh, have a nice day and uh, don't be afraid to watch it again okay bye bye